Let's talk about how to add song titles, artist names, album titles, ISRC codes to your music with Reaper. You can do it during the render process or with the media browser on any song in your library. I'm Keith from No Label, No Producer, No Limits.com. Let's dive right in. Something else that we can add to our render process is metadata. Now, metadata is additional data besides the music that gets added to a file, something like the song title, the artist name. So I can check this Add New Metadata checkbox and then click on the Metadata button, and you can see all these fields that I can edit. I've already got the title and the artist name in here. We could add an album name. That's album artist for whoever created the album art. We could add the ISRC code if we have one for distribution. Let's add uh, the performer. That's also me, Keith Livingston, and you'll see how it works. And I can hit OK or Enter. And then we can click OK or Apply. And when we render the file, the metadata will be embedded into the file. Now, the other way we can do that is via the Media Explorer. If I go to View and then docker my media explorer comes up and we can set this for list or for details details is useful for us editing the media explorer works just like a regular file explorer you can navigate up or back or forward or wherever i happen to be in this folder right here which has some mixes in it and to edit metadata in the media explorer i simply double click on a field Let's title this album. It's called Colors of the Spectrum. And then hit OK. And you'll, you'll notice it's in blue. So it hasn't written to the file yet. I'll show you how to do that in a minute. But first, let me show you how to edit multiple files. Select a file, hold down Shift, select another file, right click, and Edit Metadata Tag, Album, Colors of the Spectrum, OK. And now these titles are ready to write across all of these files. So if I wanted to edit multiple files at the same time, I could select the files again, left click, shift, left click, right click, write edited metadata to media. And now you'll see that color changes from blue to the usual font color. And now this album title is embedded into the file. So if I go to that folder, you can see it again here. And if I pull up this file in my media player, you'll see that the information is embedded right there. This video is an excerpt from my home recording mentorship program. There's a link below the video to find out more. If you found this content valuable, make sure to like, subscribe, share, and comment. It helps me out. For now, I'm Keith from No Label, No Producer, No Limits.com. Bye-bye.